country pillar. This is going to be my first tool uh, restoration job. It's going to be on this Billings wrench. And uh, let's see if I can get it to focus in here. And it, it's, of course, the post wire brushing, which you saw earlier in the video. And as you see, it's got some, uh, it's not perfect, but it, I mean, it's not a bad wrench. It's got a one inch on one end, and it's 15 sixteenths on the some, Just some wear marks. And uh, it won't take much, I don't think, to polish it up. Hi everyone, Country Peddler. I uh, finished the Billings wrench, and at least I got as far as I wanted to take it. I'm still learning a lot uh, of the, the final polish and uh, using that belt sander uh, to get the job done. This one was pretty rusted, corroded, and you couldn't even see the Billings on it when I first got it. And I gave it a vinegar bath and went through all the stages. Uh, I did give it a polish, uh, like I said, as far as I wanted to go. And it's, it's not bad. I got some still shots that show. But as I got it down with the, the sanding paper and, and the wire wheel, it seems like the metal had stress uh, lines in it, almost like fractures. And I don't know if that was when it was made. There's a weakness in the steel. I don't know. I, I did some close-up photos. You guys that have experience with these tools more than I do, you may want to take a look, see what you think. It just looks like uh, striations in the, in the steel that, I don't know if, it, if it's supposed to be that way or if it's just a, uh, it doesn't look like it's rust. Uh, and it's something to do with the steel, I think. And But I kept on grinding on it, or I should say sanding on it. And uh, I just didn't want to take too much steel off of this. And I, you know, I didn't want to touch it up too much being a, it's more of a collector type uh, wrench. Uh, but I did get it nice cleaned up. It's nice and shiny. Uh, shinier than most of my wrenches that I, if I was going to sell them. So, yeah, it, it was kind of fun doing. But there's the end results. I got some still shots. And not too bad. But like I say, it's a Billings made in the USA. And it's number 1033C. And uh, I like it. One inch by uh, on the other end. It's a 15 16th. So thanks for coming along. And that's my first tool restoration for you guys. Thanks. Have a great day, guys. Bye-bye.